Is there a small desktop out there that can top the Mac Mini? I'm Dan Ackerman. This is the HP Pavilion Mini. I guess if you're making a small desktop, you want to have the word mini in it. Uh, it's one of the few small form factor desktops that's a new design that we've seen in a while. It's actually smaller footprint wise than the Mac Mini, although it's still thicker. Now, this starts off very low end for about $300, a little bit more. You can get a, a, a Pentium processor. Uh, we have an upgraded version right here uh, with an Intel Core i3 and a one terabyte hard drive. So that's fairly hefty considering uh, this thing costs $479. Now, if you add uh, $20 more, you can get the actual entry level Mac Mini, which is this guy right here that seems positively huge by comparison, but again, um, a little bit a little bit shallower. Now for $500, you get a Core i5 CPU, it's a little bit faster, but you also get a smaller 500 gigabyte hard drive, and if you want to use this as a, uh, you know, a media server and hook it up to your TV, you might want more storage space without spending more money. I found that in benchmark tests, uh, both of these systems were actually just about as quick. They're not super fast, but for watching movies online and even doing basic office stuff and, and even basic Photoshop, uh, they'll both work just fine. Uh, this is especially well set up as a media PC because it has uh, HDMI and DisplayPort outputs. It's got plenty of USB ports. And unlike the Mac Mini, for your uh, slightly under $500, you actually get a keyboard and mouse. You don't have to buy those separately, and they're wireless. You do have to, of course, bring your own monitor or TV. I'm Dan Ackerman, and that's the HP Pavilion Mini.